Find the integral of x to the fourth over 1 plus 20, 24 to the x from x equals negative 5 to 5. This question is from the final round of the 2024 UP Mathematics Club nationwide search for the Math Wizard, which is one of the most prestigious collegiate math contests in the Philippines. In the contest, the first player to press the buzzer and provide the correct answer gains the point. Time limit for this question is 60 seconds. The limits of integration are in the form negative k to k, which should give us the idea to check first whether the integrand is an odd or even function. Unfortunately, the integrand is neither odd nor even, so this trick just wouldn't work. You can also try using standard integration techniques like the use substitution or integration by parts, but you'll see that it just doesn't work uh, nicely. In fact, the indefinite integral version of this integral likely cannot be expressed in terms of elementary functions. The actual trick here is to use what we call the King's property for definite integrals. That is, the integral for f of x from x equals a to b is equal to the integral of f of a plus b minus x from x equals a to b. In the case of an integral with limits of negative k to k, such as the one we have, this property translates to the integral of f of x being equivalent to the integral of f of negative x. Let the given integral be i, and using this king's property, i is also equivalent to the integral of negative x to the fourth power over 1 plus 20, 24 raised to the negative x power from x equals negative 5 to 5. We simplify the integrand by applying the properties of exponents. As it is, this integral is not any easier than the original version. However, note that if we add this to the original integral, we come up with something where the denominator would cancel out. Now this leaves us with the integral of only x to the fourth, which is in itself an easy integral to evaluate. Thus, twice the original integral i is equivalent to the integral of x to the fourth from negative 5 to 5. We can evaluate this using the power rule to come up with x to the 5 over 5, evaluated from still negative 5 to 5 which simplifies to 2 times 5 to the 4th power. Since this is equal to 2i, i must be equal to 5 to the 4th, or 625. And that's the final answer. Like many other problems, this problem is quite easy to evaluate once we're familiar with the trick. Hope you learned something today. Thank you for watching.